Hey guys, how's it going and welcome back to the Jeff Tutorials YouTube channel. My name is Jeff and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys a pretty sick animation glitch. So hopefully you guys do enjoy and why not drop a like and subscribe for more videos. Now before we start off in today's video, don't forget to drop a like, it'll really support my video and help the videos out. I've been getting dislikes a lot recently and it really does not affect me, it actually helps my videos rank, but it'll definitely help me out if you likers and people that support my channel will like my videos and help me out in general. Speaking of help me out, if you guys are new around here, don't forget to subscribe down below. It's only one click away from amazing Grand Theft Auto 5 videos sent out daily to your sub boxes. Don't forget to leave a comment down below. What do you guys think about this whole glitch? Do you guys want to see more money glitches, RP glitches? What kind of videos do you guys want to see before Monday or Tuesday when GTA 5 PC releases? So let's get in and hop right on in into this glitch. So I'm going to be showing you guys in this video two methods, you obviously need to be in next gen. So what you guys want to do is go into first person, take any kind of gun out, it works with the sticky bomb for god's sake, use any kind of gun or any kind of weapon of your choice, stick it out or aim it in any sort of way, and then get any passenger out of a vehicle that you need to steal. It cannot be your friend, it has to be an actual NPC out of the game, and as soon as you get inside there, you are good. So you actually did this glitch and it looks really sick. And the cool thing you can do is actually experiment with different cars and different vehicles to see what looks best out of all of them. If you guys see a vehicle or try a vehicle that looks really amazing, feel free to leave a comment down below and tell me how it looks and how you did it and what was the name of the vehicle. So same concept applies here with the BMX, just point any kind of gun and then point your hand out, then get your friend off of the bicycle, you want to use it with a friend because it's going to be a little bit easier, with an NPC it is a little bit harder, and you can do this with pretty much any vehicle, you can do it with a car, a bicycle, a truck, pretty much anything, and it's really sick. The cool thing with the bicycle is that you can almost see a modded vehicle or a modded bicycle on the street if you have a minigun or some kind of big weapon out, so it definitely looks cool and this is a great glitch to try for funny moments or something to spare your time in GTA 5 Online. So there you go, two really cool glitches in GTA 5 Online that you can do on your free time. So hopefully you guys did enjoy and why not drop a like and subscribe down below for more amazing GTA 5 videos sent out daily to your sub boxes. You guys will not regret clicking that red subscribe button down below because I have one of the lowest unsubscribe rates on YouTube in this whole community. This is really cool and I'm just trying to show to you guys that my subs stay with me because as soon as they subscribe they love the content and they're they don't even have a doubt of leaving this channel and unsubscribing and subscribing to someone else that posts similar content to me but is not as good so hopefully you guys did enjoy and subscribe down below again for more amazing gta 5 videos sent out daily to your sub boxes also feel free to follow me on twitter twitter.com forward slash jeff tutorials overlay will be on screen right now to stay updated on my news personal life and a whole bunch of other stuff also feel free to chat me on there if you guys have any questions but anyway guys thank you so much for watching this video and i'll talk to you guys in the next one.